degrees, and we're already seeing some light of rain through parts of southern Miami. Some of that associated with, of course, Hurricane Ian. Watching this hurricane very closely, look at the rain bands associated with this very well-organized storm. The waters around the Caribbean quite warm right now, 86 degrees, and that's exactly what it needs to continue to gain more energy. In fact, strengthen to a major hurricane as it continues to make, uh, well, towards landfall, really, over the western end of Cuba. It is going to continue to strengthen, move up the Gulf Coast, and make impact somewhere between Tampa and the Florida Panhandle. Of course, we'll watch that very carefully as it continues to intensify over the next couple of days. Our heat here intensifies as well. Today, tomorrow will be the peak of the heat. And it looks like we've got some excessive heat risks that are going to be quite high, very high, as we get into tomorrow and Wednesday. So that means heat-related illness is very possible. If you're out and about, please always remember to drink water, take plenty of breaks if you have to be working under these weather conditions. And remember to check on our elderly, our neighbors, especially those who do not have air conditioning. Always a good reminder to never leave children, your pets, inside a vehicle. Lake Arrowhead, here's your forecast, feeling more like summer for the first few days of the first week of fall. 86 degrees expected today, 85 tomorrow, well above average. By Wednesday, we are going to look for a small chance, maybe 10% uh, for some light showers up there, some convective clouds forming and a little bit of humidity. Otherwise, if you're headed to the beach, maybe you got the day off, lucky you today. Uh, temperatures on the sand in the 70s to even low 80s. Surf heights maintaining two to four feet, kind of a combo swell out of the south and west. That water temperature really refreshing into the low 70s. 70s and that moderate rip current risk out there. So just be careful always. 89 uh, today for downtown LA, 91 tomorrow, and then we start to see that cool down as we get to this upcoming weekend. It should be a nice fall-like weekend coming up with lots of sunshine. Triple digits, of course, for the inland areas, especially in the Coachella Valley, 109 expected today, and then cooling off by this weekend to 101, if you can call it that, 99 by next week, Monday. All right, let's do a couple TV shout-outs before I run out of time. Happy 17th birthday to you, Eileen, your dad, sent us a photo of you and your siblings love you very much and a happy eighth birthday to peter uh you and your siblings here your grandpa and your grandma flora love you so much and i know your brother actually celebrated a birthday recently as well so happy happy birthdays to all of you um keep those pictures coming don't forget to attach the photo that's really important email tv shoutouts at fox.com and we'll try to share them here on the daily oh you're back that's